I V M. Never ask a man his salary and a female her age. That's been a universal norm for ages. But a sip of finance is a small attempt to break these stereotypes and learn to talk about finance, especially for women. We are no longer afraid of aging and estate planning comes easy to us too. Although estate planning is not to be done when you get old. It has to be done as soon as you start handling finances and it has to be upgraded as you get older. Today we shall continue with our discussion on estate planning. Welcome to a sip of finance podcast by Priyanka Acharya. I'm your host Shanali and this is a lady special podcast that will help you get better with your finances. Conceptualized by Priyanka Acharya, a financial consultant who simplifies a lot of financial jargon for you. She comes with 14 plus years of experience in this field and has helped many grow their money. So, you can now learn simple finance not just in English but in seven other languages. Let's get started. We already discussed the will and its importance. Let's not wait to turn 60 or more to make a will. Even if there's only a small bank account in our name, it's a good idea to make a will and upgrade it when necessary. We discuss the will without any legal formalities. If you want to advance to a registered will, then you just need to register it the same way as you register a new property. It is simple and quick. Okay, let me tell you about a real incident. A friend of mine, Shobha, lost her father. Now she, along with her brother, were sorting out the financial arrangements for their mother, who is a housewife, who never knew where her husband's finances were. She just knew the fixed amount she got every month to run the house. Shobha called me once and said she needs help. Listeners, just see how things can get messy. Her father was hospitalized due to COVID. was admitted for 10 days and then he couldn't survive he did have a mediclaim policy but never liked agents getting commissions so he had done a diy do it yourself and done his mediclaim policy online while doing this he may have felt why to have a nominee for a mediclaim after all mediclaim is for my treatment expenses i will get them in fact he had also purchased the cheapest premium policy The result firstly when he was admitted the hospital told Shobha that the mediclaim policy is such that they will have to settle the bill on their own and later claim that money from the company already that was a big hurdle Shobha and her brother arranged money from their savings and borrowed from a few friends they thought it's just a phase we will get the reimbursement from the company and repay our friends except it wasn't so easy now the twist in the tale shobha's father passed away during the treatment and he had no nomination in his policy the company as a rule refused to release the payment without a will or a document called succession certificate shobha in tears said i just wish that dad could have spent a minute and typed in mom's name as a nominee Now this process is just giving us the run all around. Friends, this is just one of the many situations that happen around us. Estate planning is not tedious. It is a necessity. Just like the discomfort we feel while waxing or doing our eyebrows, this process is worth the hassle too. And like you saw, it is not necessary that you have crores of wealth in order to do all this. Now the point is what to do. We have already discussed easy steps to make the will. Now let's look at three situations where you have to especially make sure that your estate planning is up to date. This knowledge will help you and your family in many many ways. Step 1. As soon as you or your spouse switch jobs or businesses or start a new source of income, immediately review your estate planning. 
Perhaps you have a change of location, shift in residence. You may buy or rent a new place. If you change jobs, the employer will have some new benefits for you. Many of us create our own investment lists, but forget to add what our employer gives us apart from our salary. If they have provided you with any insurance or shares, you must make it a part of your estate planning. Step 2. If you have a will, there needs to be someone who will take care of procedures in your absence. In legal terms, we call this person an executor. To make it simple, for an unregistered will, have a close friend who is trustworthy and unbiased. For a registered will, have a competent legal professional. There is a procedure to execute a will after the death of the will creator. Always understand how it works and have a person for it. Let's spend a few moments on this crucial point. Step 3. Your estate is not just your property, gold and investments. You also need a list of loans and liabilities that you have taken. If you are a woman, ghar ki lakshmi, you definitely need to know the family borrowings. Also, there may be a lot of premium memberships we subscribe to like clubs, associations and all. It would be a great idea to list down those as well. And what is to be done in future if the member is no more? There are little little things that matter a lot in finance. And that's why I bring you these little episodes sip by sip. Let us go to the next concept in the next episode. Till then, keep enjoying, keep organizing, love your financial literacy and enjoy your financial liberation. That's a wrap on this episode of A Sip of Finance Podcast. We will see you in the coming week. Thank you for tuning in. If you found this podcast helpful, do give us a shout out on social media and tag us. It will help us empower more people. If you want to reach out to Priyanka, she is available on Instagram at Priyanka U Acharya and on LinkedIn as Priyanka Acharya. You can listen to this podcast on the IVM Podcasts app, website or wherever you get your podcasts. Do follow us on social media. We are at IVM Podcasts on Twitter, Facebook and Instagram. See you in the next episode. Thank you for listening to A Sip of Finance by Priyanka Acharya. There's a quick survey to fill out on ivmpodcast.com slash survey. It lets us know a little bit more about who's listening to us. And you know what? We're going to do a few prizes. So, I mean, like, we'll do a random drawing of, like, maybe 10 people and we'll send you all some swag. Remember, that's ivmpodcast.com slash survey where you can fill out the survey. Hello, 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 everybody. Welcome to another great week on the IVM Podcast Network. This World Yoga Day, Ashton is joined by global yoga icon and lifestyle influencer Sunena Reiki. They talk about how one can take care of themselves using yoga. Catch this only on The Habit Coach. On the Filter Coffee Podcast, Karthik speaks to author Vineet Karnik on the business of sports. On Smarter with Sid, Siddharth explains how the human library in Denmark works. On Marathi Kirkitan, the Deshmukh share unique incidents they came across while reading. And on Ek Jiski Finance, Priyanka teaches us how to write a will. Just a reminder to everybody, the IVM merchandise is now available. You can go to the IVM podcast website and click on the shop tab. Check out our first collection of t-shirts. Also, do follow us on social media. We're IVM Podcast on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and LinkedIn. And I'd like to remind you all that it is really, really helpful for us when you do recommend this show or any of our other shows to a friend. Word of mouth is great for us, and it's really a great way for us to grow our audience and have more people for you to discuss your podcast consumptions with. Also, don't forget to rate us on any platform you're listening on, and you can also check us out on YouTube at ivmpodcast.com slash YouTube. We have a list of the YouTube channels we are on. And finally, we'd like to thank our sponsors this week, Cap Gemini, Intel VPro, and Intel Future But Now Wonderful. Thank you so much for making this possible.